no like that's my daughter she was doing that one this one yeah. oh. I am Veronique Jacobs and I am in year 12. We went to Tate Modern um, um, in a pop, ex pop art exhibition to get ideas for our destruction piece and I took pieces from the basement that we have and I took pictures of the pipes. I spray painted them in a gold metallic color to make it look a little bit better because it was had holes and there was gaps in it. I found cans on the floor. I painted them red to get a negative response from them and then I took a picture of the grounds at our school and then I combined them to show the different aspects of our school and show that our school was being destroyed by all these cans that people are leaving around. And I, what I did is I brought two negative things of destroyed cans and the destructed pipes to give that response within the art. And our site-specific work was done in the, at a graveyard that I found in Somerset. And what I did is I placed my final piece and I photoshopped it within the art of the site-specific. <laughs> I'm Evie Fisher and I'm in Year 12. I'm taking IB Visual Arts. I started with GCSE Art um, and I found that through doing IB Visual Arts that you really have to um, develop within your own ideas. You really have to explore yourself rather than um, exploring your own ideas but it's more identity. So with this project I started with drawing self-portraits from observation using a mirror in various um, mediums like charcoal and painting and we experimented with different lighting um, so you got like a lot of contrast within the images and from that we also explored the work of other artists um, trying to produce pieces in a similar style. Uh, I really liked the work of Lucian Freud and Jenny Savile because um, I think they had quite contrasting um, painting styles but it was all really detailed and very interesting to look at visually. Um, so when we had to develop our ideas um, we looked at ourselves and who we are as a person and um, I think I quite surprised myself when I was making my images because quite a lot of these are quite dark especially this one up here whereas people normally associate me as like quite a bright very like happy person so I think it was quite um, a surprise for me and other people to see something so dark and kind of contrasting to what they see me as. When developing your own ideas it can be quite challenging um, especially when you have to really look inside yourself but I found like the art department are really helpful um, and the teachers can really um, help you really express what you want to show well, I just really love creative subjects and I love being able to make anything and kind of express things through either visual or performance, um, anything like that. So I just find it so interesting to be able to express different things that way. <laughs> My name is Isabel and I study higher IB photography. I studied art GCC before this and I wanted to study photography afterwards so I chose to ch um, do the visual arts IB photography course and it's actually really good because it has a lot of like art aspects towards it and through it. So for example this is like a um, relief 
At the beginning of a course, we went to exhibitions to get influence from other artists and photographers. And one of the main exhibitions we went to was The World Goes Pop at Tate Modern, which is a pop art exhibition. And there were two artists that influenced this work the most because of their like destruction aspects within their pop art. So I tried to get that in the work. For example, the spray paint represents urban decay and the Coca-Cola images are quite iconic in pop art. And then this led to our um, site-specific installation, which is that piece over there. And it's based upon Gordon Matterclark's um, photo montages, which he splits his photos, then he puts them together um, with like a line present or something connecting them. So that's where that large line is from. Um, and it's just, I place the work different site-specific locations around the school in the dungeon since that's where most of this in the first work is present, so they link. And then from that, for the main exam piece, I did the vessel, which is the sculptural piece there. And that also connects with a lot of architect architectural aspects throughout it with the London architecture and how it links with like natural forms, architecture due to the shape of the work, but it contrasts with the man-made architecture. And throughout the work is different aspects also with light. So like with the window and then the darkness from around the pipes and the darkness from a bottom leading up to the lightness and the black and white images which let a lot of light through due to the transparency and how it illuminates the work.
of art, visual art. Um, I, st I started GCSE art in Cobham Hall and then I found the art in this school is really good and I decided to continue doing visual art in my IB courses. Um, so we have a quite small class in Cobham Hall which the teachers can always help us developing our own ideas like independently. So this this is like one of our projects of doing our self identity. The observation drawing of myself is more like I can to use more warm colour. Even um, my expression is more cold and without any smile because I want to show the audience of me. People see me as a really mean person but actually I'm warm inside and also in the big painting, like our final outcome, is um, it's about myself um, in Hong Kong, which I come from Hong Kong. So I want to show the audience of how do I feel when I was like younger in Hong Kong instead of in Hopham Hall. So um, Hong Kong is more crowded and busy all the time. It's not like England really um, um, have a lot of wood. <laughs> So to show by showing us like um, busy street in Hong Kong, and also I use kind of um, the fish fish eye lens effect on my painting, and so it's curved. So the, when the audience look at the painting, it's more um, like walking down the street, like the st store is surround you surrounded by the store, and um, it, in this painting, I want to sh also show my identity of. Um, myself feeling of a bit lonely when I was younger, which my parents always away, and um, so in that busy street, there's lots of shop, but there's none of the, any other people. So that's all I want to show. Sorry.